Welcome back everybody and it's just another day here in Japan. Yeah, but today is kind of special because I actually have the day to me and the kids. Naoki has a regular day shift today, so yeah, I actually get to do some things on my own that don't include Naoki. So first off, it's going to be a day of shopping local and that means not really going to chain places, but places that are um, owned by locals in my area, if that makes sense. Yeah, it should make pretty much common sense shopping local, but not everybody knows what that means. So yeah, it's not a chain place, like a chain restaurant or a chain store, but a place that is owned locally. And the first place today is a taiyaki place. If you've never heard of taiyaki, basically it's like a pancake filled with something. Whether it be chocolate custard or regular egg custard or I've had ones that have like okonomiyaki filling or even pizza filling. Yeah, I've actually never been to this shop before and we pass it every day and have really been wanting to go. So I'm gonna go and I'm gonna pick up a couple of taiyaki to try. I'm hoping they have something special, but that's not always the case. So these are the flavors. We have a red bean. This is a white bean. They have custard, which is pretty standard. And then this one, I'm actually not quite sure what this is but it's some kind of bean. An means bean. So like this is white bean, on. This is on red bean. Now before I show you what we got, um, I'm gonna go pick up Mary and she's actually gonna have some of this with me. It's gonna be part of her snack today. So yeah, she's actually never really had taiyaki before so I'm kind of curious on if she's gonna like it. But yeah, we shall see. Let's go get Mary. And of course, the hardest part of the whole kindergarten thing is climbing these deadly stairs. a special treat for you. Turn around, look. <gasps> look at this. This is, this is, this is taiyaki. Taiyaki. Yeah. Do you want to try? Hi. Let's try some taiyaki. So I ended up getting a regular custard for Mary. And I got the white bean for myself because I have actually never had the white bean before. So here is Oh, taiyaki. What is that? Is that a fish? Yeah. yeah, it's a fish. So taiyaki is traditionally a fish shape. So let's try. Yeah, is it good, Mary? Is it good? Mm -hmm. I'm gonna try the white bean. Mmm, okay. that's really good. You can sit right here if you want. Okay, on the floor. On the ground. That's fine too. Yeah. Mmm. <coughs> Yummy? Yeah, George, I know. I'm sitting down. George doesn't like it when I have him in the wrap or in a carrier and I sit down. He doesn't like it. But this is surprisingly really good. I like the white bean so much more than the red bean, surprisingly. It's still sweet. Mm. It's really good. I don't know if you can see that, but it's really good. You want to try some of this one? You 
want this one? Okay. <laughs> um. So the next place we're gonna go is lunch. And I'm actually gonna get some bagel sandwiches. I'm so excited because bagels are not a popular thing here in Japan. And I cannot wait for some bagels. So this is the place. I'm so excited. This is actually the first time she has fallen asleep directly after kindergarten. So, I mean, it's a good thing for me because I'd rather her take a nap early rather than later. So, yeah, and I finally get a little bit of peace and quiet. <sighs> we are back home and I have all of my lovely bagels. Oh my gosh. They all looked so good. I just wanted to eat them all. Yes. Bagels are a hot commodity here in Japan. And I haven't had a proper bagel in a very, very, very long time. Yes. Um, and that's including Costco bagels. Like I haven't had a Costco bagel in forever it seems because i just stopped buying them because i don't have the freezer space for them i would rather freeze other things besides bagels so yeah i got some bagels for lunch and some bagels for breakfast time so let me show you what bagels i got so like my mouth is watering just thinking about eating these bagels but let's just let's just show you i got a standard blueberry bagel i love blueberry bagels Oh my gosh, it, it looks uh, delicious. I decided to get this one. It's a cranberry and walnut bagel. And it just sounded interesting and it just looks really, really good. So, gonna have that for breakfast one day. This one, I'm actually not sure exactly what it is. I think it's a brown sugar bagel. Um, it is their special bagel of the day. I was just like, oh, special bagel of the day. Let's go ahead and get that and try it. Don't even know what it is. Kind of has that everything bagel vibe, but it's not. This is black pepper, I believe. And inside is ham and cheese. Yes, it's a ham and cheese bagel, but it's already been baked. It's not like cut with cold ham and cheese. So yeah, that's exciting. Mainly got this one for Mary because I thought she would really like it, but she might not like the ham, so I might end up eating it. Who knows? Just a plain cheese bagel. Yes, I plan on putting some ham that I have in the fridge inside for another ham sandwich for myself. But yeah, I'm super excited to try these. They just look so delicious. Since Mary is asleep and not gonna eat lunch obviously right now, I'm going to go ahead and eat, but I decided to eat the ham and cheese because it just looks so good. So here it is, my ham and cheese bagel with pepper on the outside here. Time to taste test it. Oh my gosh. I'm so excited. You have no idea to have an actual proper bagel. Like, mm. And no, I'm not going to slice it in half to eat it because it's already made to be eaten like this, unlike the other ones. I'll probably slice the other ones in half, of course, to eat, but this, it has ham and cheese inside baked, so I'm not going to slice it in half. The pepper, it is a bit much because of how coarsely grained it is, but it's good. I can't complain about it at all because... It's a fantastic bagel. The last place we're gonna go on our little shop local trip here is my local vegetable stand. And yeah, I love this vegetable stand. The old lady who works it, oh my gosh, so cute. I'm hope I can get to be her age, but I doubt it. Um, yeah. And there she is, my little vegetable stand. Apple. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, oh. 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 Oh
Okay, let's do this one. Washa. Okay. Arigatou gozaimashita. I have achieved my goal, which was to get cabbage. This thing is massive. Can you see this? One dollar. Yes, 100 yen for this massive cabbage. Yeah, can't get a better deal than my local vegetable stand. Well guys, I think that does it for today's uh, let's shop locally. Yes, um, we'll see what else I can find in my area. Yeah, I want to do more videos like this, so we'll see. But I can't promise anything because I do live in the countryside so there isn't a whole lot but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed so please like and subscribe and i'll see you in my next video bye